have you not heard everything that everyone is telling you <laughs> like you have to make zoos graphics whatever is your niche whatever you are talking about you can make cute graphic cute illustrations using some graphic design app and this is extremely easy and today because i love to help i am going to show you how to make graphics for your instagram posts in canva so if you are entirely new in this graphic design world you might wonder what the heck is canva well canva it's like the other app that i always talk about this is basically a software a tool where you can design whatever you are thinking of it can be anything from flyers to birthday cards to instagram posts instagram stories they even do instagram reels you can add animated stickers elements backgrounds anyways whatever is the graphic design that you are thinking in your mind you can make it happen in Canva. Anyways, if it's the first time you see me, hi, my name is Justin Lamer. I am walking into the digital marketing world and here on YouTube, I love to talk about editing tips and social media. So if you like that kind of videos, don't forget to subscribe down below to never miss any of my future uploads. Now, let's get started. Okay, so the first things that we want to do on our computer, it's going into Google and you can find Canva like this, canva.com. And from there, see, he is recognizing me, but you can totally create your own account, do all of that. And when you're done, you can start what I'm going to show you. So here on search, you can tap Instagram post. Into Instagram post, you will get tons of different templates already made about different people that are providing those for you for free for example if i'm choosing this one you can see over here that there's a little crown and it says free so that means that i can click on it and if i have a free account i will be able to change everything that is happening on this template and make it my own let's go back to what's going going on into those Instagram templates. If there's certain colors that you are looking for, you can absolutely choose one of those colors. For example, let's say that my Instagram is all about pink colors. Well, I'm going to go into the pink templates. The one that I love the most, it's the gray or white color because this is all natural colors. So I know that I will find something that matches is what I am looking for. So if I go into the white here, I will get all the templates that are really chic and natural colors. And from here, you can browse and see what's free and what's not. Most of those templates are free. So as I was saying, you don't have to have Canva Pro to, you know, make some graphics because you can totally use those. All right, so if there is a couple of templates that you like, let me show you what I do. So when I really like something that someone made, I'm gonna go on it, like for example, this one. I am going to do that that little like here and so it has been added to my likes so I will be able to find this template again let's browse again all right I really do love this one here with that marble on the back so I'm going to do a like again and yeah basically you do that with everything that you like once you've done that you can go into home and into all your folders here are your likes so you're going to go into likes all the little templates that i like and that i can reuse and change however i like so let's take the last one for example the one that we took earlier and if you click on it it says use this template so you're gonna do use this template and here you have access to 
all the work of this lady and you will be able to change every single detail so you can 100% make it your own so let's see for example that is the background you can either delete it if you touch the delete in the keyboard it will come white you can also go into background over here and here you will get different kind of backgrounds maybe we can do this one instead you will have to find something that is free but as usual here it says free on the bottom so you will be able to see what is free and what is not so you can use whatever background you feel like it can even be your own pictures now you will be able to change colors and you your brand color I click on the area that I want to change and I will go into that square that says color and here are my brand colors so this is a pro feature so if you have the free version of Canva you won't be able to have access to your brand color already on the side with all the colors but it doesn't really matter because you can always find your colors with the X color type on your color numbers and find your colors i'm going to use my brand color and i'm going to change this brown and that brown over there in that red chalk color this one i'm going to put this color and that blue one i'm going to change for that pink then for those elements that she added you can either reuse them so use the same one and obviously add the color of your choice black and that one i'm going to do maybe white so i changed the color of that shape over there so you can select the text and it's going to tell you what fonts she used you can use your own font when you have canva pro you can upload your own fonts if you're not you can use fonts that they already have if those fonts have little crowns on the side it means that only users of canva pro can use this font so they are not free if you don't have canva pro you need to use the fonts that don't have that crown on the side so let's use enter here and you are going to double click and wrote you on love is louder that would be my quote and if you don't know what quote to write you always can go to pinterest you can write motivational quotes don't wish for it work for it love that one and so here me i'm going to use one of my font and if you go in that corner over here or any of those corner and you extend it it's gonna make your font bigger you can see the changes here on the, on the top then you can drag and put it wherever you want and here you are you have your first graphic instagram post i would recommend to always add your instagram and all at the bottom of your graphic so when people share it they can always have access to who made that quote on Instagram. So that is what you can do from any of those templates that you selected before. Okay, so to make a graphic for your Instagram post from scratch, you will go into create a design here and you will do Instagram post. So it's going to bring you to another window with like a blank square. So this is what you want. And you can either do a white background or you can choose the color of your choice, like for my brand color, or you can choose an image. There's landscape, patterns, gradient, texture, whatever you feel like. And then you can add some element so if you go into elements and you do maybe abstract shape you will find those shape this one is pro so if you only want to use abstract shape that are free you can go into that filter here and press free apply filter so here are going to be all of the elements that are free so we're going to use only three elements for me to show you so let's take this one so each element it's possible to change the color so you can use your brand color once again you can do whatever you want resize it or make it smaller it's up to you let's make it this way and more like 
that. So I just have one part of the graphic and then you can go back into element and add some more. <laughs> are able to obviously add some text so you will go into text add a heading and write so that would be a really informative graphic for your Instagram and then as I said earlier you can make it bigger we're going to go into element and we're going to choose maybe this one because that's free if you want your title to pop out a little bit of the background you can go into effect and add a shadow so best tips to start your business and we're going to go into element and look for number <laughs> to design your graphic you can also add a couple of other things you can even add a video with like I don't know some tips a kind of example of what your tips are about I would totally do that for my own Instagram so yeah basically this is how you can make your graphic from scratch now you just have to get your creativity out there because this one is just like lots of example <laughs> Guys, I hope I answered your question on how to make graphic for your Instagram posts in Canva. If you like this video, if you learned something today, anything that I have done in Canva and you didn't know about, please like this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel since I am planning on making more Canva tutorial, over tutorial, everything graphic design. So if you don't want to miss any of those future videos that are coming on my channel, subscribe now. Until next time, take care. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week. All right, bye.